everyone, today I have Birch Box for the month of April. And this is my first month of Birch Box Beta, which I don't even know if I did right. I don't know if you're supposed to be like selecting something to skip or if I did that right or if I didn't do it right. So if anyone knows what you're supposed to be doing with the Birch Box Beta, let me know because I don't know if it's supposed to be a lot different or if it's just you're supposed to be more selective. This is what the box looks like this month. It says magic inside and it smells really jasmine-y right now so hopefully or like lavender. Oh pretty inside the lid and so this is what's inside the box. First things first is this. It says level natural shower bomb so that sounds nice. I bet that's what I'm smelling. It says it's lavender full size eight dollars so this must be a full size. You put it in an aromatherapy bomb by your drain while showering and menthol and lavender infused steam will open your sinuses, soothe muscles, and calm your mind. I could really use this because I have been struggling with this cold for a while. Oh, it looks like there's two of them. That's really nice. They look like this. I think this is something new and different, and I'm really going to like this because I like the smell of lavender and like menthol, and I have been struggling, if you can tell by my nose, with this cold. So then next, it's a purple thing, and it is Michael Todd Blue Algae Antibacterial Toner, full size $19. And it says this is a gentle toner, uses antibacterial power of blue-green algae to rid the skin of oil, sweat, and impurities without causing dryness or irritation. That sounds nice. I haven't used a good toner in a long time. I think I could really like this, and I used to love toner, so maybe this one would be really good. Smoothing balm, I'm guessing for hair. It's vegan. It's $30. It's by number four, Jour de Autumn Soothing Balm. It minimizes frizz, gives hair a soft, touchable texture, and protects against humidity and heat damage, which I don't really have frizzy hair, but maybe I'll try it. Then there's this by Sissa Pear. It's tiger grass cream. Never heard of anything like this before. Um, it says that this is full size 48. This isn't a full size. It's formulated with the medicine herb Centella Acetica. No idea if I'm saying that right. This healing, calming, and deeply hydrating cream treats redness, blemishes, inflammation, and other irritations. So I guess we'll see if this is any good. Looks neat. And then last but not least is this lip product in this kind of rose goldy lid packaging. And this is by the Beauty Crop GRLPWR Lips Liquid Lipstick. I'm a boss, but spelled differently. Full size $14.95. It, um... It's a liquid lipstick that delivers a long wearing matte look. And yeah, so I guess we'll just see what kind of color this is. Mine looks very like red. <laughs> and it's even appearing more red on camera, but it's kind of like a, a burnt red or like a deeper red. Not super red red, but on camera it's looking really red red. But this might be nice. I'm not crazy about red, but it looks like it's drying down and I'm hoping it doesn't stain my hand because I probably wasn't thinking that through. I have somewhere to go today. So let's hope I don't have a super red hand. But yeah, that's everything in my box this month. It was a better birch box. I'm not sure if it's just because I did the birch, if I did the birch box beta or if because I just happened upon a good box and I have no idea what I'm doing with birch box beta, which is likely the case. So I like everything in my box this month. Um, I'm really excited for the toner and that shower thing which i'm really needing to use today because i am so stuffy if you could tell i'm pretty miserable <laughs> with this cold for like two weeks so yeah i'll see you guys later i hope you enjoyed this birch box and let me know what you got in your birch box and let me know what i'm doing wrong with birch box beta see you guys later